Right, here's the junction point. Go down there to my special coom. I reckon, so you could have a load of identical points like this, but I think that is it. I think it's down there, because I recognise this tree that's fallen. Yeah, this looks like it to me. And I would have looked over there. And if we see any pink netting, then we know we're in the right place anyway. Yeah, it's got to be there. Damn, yeah. That's it, girl. Hat off again for five minutes. Have it off whenever you're in the shade so you don't get overheated with it on all the time. You'll need it when you're outside. So yeah, I had, I'd never done that track before what I've done today. I don't think I have. Or if I have, I've done it by accident. And not taking any notice of it. Yeah, I remember this tree. It's still alive. Yeah, so straight down. You, you wouldn't know. I always thought it was much wider and bigger, but... No. You're doing well. So you've come out, you've explored that track, which is what you wanted to do, girl. But I'm not quite sure if that is it, but I think it is. This is another one further down, the same, which would join up. Because there was a track going across, if you remember. There was another track going across. So it could be there's two junctions, which you'll have to look out for next time you come down. Right, so here we go, folks. Having a beautiful time. We'll soon be in very, very hot territory, though. Um, very hot. There'll be a period where there's no shelter. You know, do you know what I mean? When I go across the area of Sandy Beauty, not right across it, because I don't do that in the summer. I go lower down with the sorts of bushes. I've only got to do a little bit out and then down through past Tinian's farm. It's all very open. But there could be, once you get near the farm, past Tinian's farm, it could be some shade. I'm not sure if there is. But, uh, right, I'm going to turn off again now. We've done a little bit more recce. A little bit more recce, haven't we? Over and out. Of course, if I didn't want to go put, go across the top, I could do the lower track again. No, I don't want to do that this time. No. Right then, so I've just emerged from a path, path that you can't see from here, which turns off there. I've done a nice little loop, exploring. And I'm glad I did, because it makes you more familiar with everything. I still don't know what those canisters are for that I see now. I've put my hat back on. Last time I was here, I've been down and up that on two different occasions. That takes you up to another gate, not far away. But today I'm going through this gate. There we go. I did see two people. They'd only just come up the hill. So they might have rested for a few minutes here. There's lots of bike trails. I've done lots of these as well, walking. It's going to get quite hot now. I've got my hat on. I've... Had a bit more picnic. It's always good to top up the energy levels and the glucose levels um, and the protein. So I've had half my cheese and half my tomatoes. Um, so you have to keep nourishing the body as you go, you see. Little snacks are good. I mean, some people go on a walk and they go and have a massive meal and then walk back. Everyone's different. If that suits you, do it. So anyway, we're coming up to the gate. 
belong to the area of outstanding natural beauty everyone. I've spoken about a lot and the ferns, look at them now. Look at the ferns now. So in a minute there'll be no shade. Possibly a little bit of, uh, by the odd bush. Possibly. Yeah, they've got all these containers around with water in. I don't know if they're... They could even be for fire reasons if there was a fire to have these stationed around. Um, I, I've got no idea, but I wouldn't be surprised. Because where else are you going to get water up here? This is the gate with the funny mechanism. Just seen a load of people coming across now. Probably young people. They're all out this weather. They do sort of some sort of hike. It's a part of their school thing before they break up for the summer. I met a load of them last year. I met a load of them last year. Some of them are, are polite. Some of them aren't so polite. Right, I'm just going to take a picture of the sign in a minute for you. Yeah, I've just seen a couple of a plane take off and a plane land. I'm just doing going down a slightly different route, which I don't normally do. But I thought it's good to take a diversion sometimes, just off the main track, because I'm bound to meet it again. It's, it's over there. I have come quite away from it, but um, it should curve up and join it again. It's just sometimes to Good to get further in. Like I said, I don't want to meet the cows and the and the horses. All the, I don't mind the horses so much, but if there's a big gang of cows up here, God. Got to keep my hat on. It keeps blowing off. I do need it on because what it is with the hat, um, you could suddenly get very hot and not realise it with the wind blowing, you see. But this wind is gorgeous. It's gorgeous, this wind. <sighs> no sign of the cows, though, but like I said, they could all be over. She can be a marker. I'll join up with what's called the parade in a minute and then I'll just have to bear around. I rarely do this route. Rarely, probably hardly ever actually. Yeah, there's lots of little pathways you can take. You can't see the hill fort at the moment, it's behind the Robert Warren trees. cheese and I haven't got indigestion yet. I only eat half of it. I've been taking it very very steady though. Um, it's very bumpy here by the way so it will be bumpy. I'm trying to hold the camera still. Um, this is a, see this track here? This is made by the well it could be made by a vehicle but it could be made by the cows. They like following behind each other. this on panorama. I don't know it's working. It's good 
to experiment now. In a minute when we get up higher I'll be able to see just about Steep Home. Yeah, I'm not under any pressure, I'm just taking my time. I've kept sensible, I've been, I've kept in the wood most of the time. And it is hot, but the thing is, there's a quite, a, quite a breeze, but it's beautiful. It's very cooling. It's not what I call a hot breeze. It's just slightly off warm. So it's not nippy, it's not cold, but it's cooling. It's a cool, warm breeze, if you know what I mean. Little tweeter. I don't know what that is, good type of sparrow, I suppose. Right, just turn back and have another look at that lovely Robert Warren that I've been walking in, exploring a little bit more. Turn it off now. <laughs> 